Hello! Do you want to get on the top 100 list? And you uh, wonder if it's possible to do it? Well, I can say I made it, so I think also you can do it. But there is a 5 step guide that I'm going to go through now that you have to be thinking go, thinking through and you have to follow that to get on the top 100. There may be other ways for to do this, but this is the best tips that I can give you based on what I have gone through. I managed to do the to get on the top 100 after one and a half day, um, and I'm quite happy about that. And and uh, the max place I went will come up onto was 58, and I was on 58. I was happy, and I'm gonna tell in the end of this video why I was happy, and why I didn't continue further up on the list. So, well, if you want to know this, follow the, along and I'm gonna tell you the different steps to take. The first step is step one. It's timing. I think it's really important to do this at the correct timing. The correct timing for going for top 100 is when there's coming a new update with new pets. When there's coming a new pets to the game, they will have much more stronger power than our old pets. And also, as you can see on the top bottom here, the score that this player now have on the, on the bottom has started to rise, but the first two, three days, the score for number 100 is almost the same as before the update. So this is what you have to do. And it's all about timing. So you have these two, three days to manage to get up to top 100 with at least the strongest pets uh, team as possible. If you wait further than this or longer than this, you need to have much stronger pets team and then you have to fight against scores that you see on the top here already now. It's now with very short time, it's gonna be really high scores here, okay? Then it's step number two, that is preparation. Before the, the update is coming, you need to prepare. I prepared for three to four weeks before this and for every time you're gonna try to the top 100 that is a part of preparation what you need to do is that you need to sell dark matter pets uh, when they have a high price right so they will have a high price as soon after the update that you already are playing on like this update here now has still a good price for the dark matter pets that we have in, in this game and I have a lot of them now after this these are still going for like two to two and a half billion each one and you can get a lot of uh, diamonds out of that so this is about selling all your dark matter pets because these cannot be fused they cannot be transfers and so on and for the last week you can be keep the last week you can keep this dark matter but this is also one thing because normally updates for Preston had the new patch has been 15 times stronger but now the last update there was only like two and a half times stronger so when they, when they are 50 times stronger than new pets then there will be no value at all there's absolutely no value of keeping the old dark matter pets they will not help you on the top 100 okay and if if they are only two and a half, then the last week keep those, and then you later on gonna rebuy dark matter pets. But I come back to that in the next points. And the other thing is that you need to collect at least 100 billion diamonds, and at least 100 billion in the v diamond value in exclusives. So it's about up to 200 billion at least. That's what you need for for ma managing to get the top 100 so it's not an easy task you need to get a lot of value before you do this or you have to do it while you do it all other pets that you have now i only have mythicals on me but if all other legendary and so on that you have all those you need to f fuse up to the best legendary and make it dark matter so that you keep there. I had for before this update, I had about 700 dark matter of the best legendary, and that helped me uh, a lot in the beginning, and so on. But you don't need as ma many as 700 uh, as I had, but they will be uh, for help, okay? Because th those, when it come to the new update, you can fuse them up to the next legendary. 
that's the good thing with legendary pets you can keep the power and fuse them up and they will just take less space so this is also a thing that is very important because if the new pets is 15 times stronger this is a way better step if the new pets is only two and a half times stronger it's not that important to keep the legendaries okay and the next step is that you need to find some friends to help you unless you have tremendous of strength and so on but you will need to have someone else making the pets dark matter for you that you can buy from in the first day so of course you can go to the market buying and so on but that will take a lot of time it's much better that you have a lot of your friends that you say i'm gonna buy them for for either one price and afterwards you get the rest or you buy it for full price at the beginning so that they know they can rely on you buying from them because then they can make this dark matter for you so that, that is all of the points for the step number two preparation then we are coming to step number three doing there are for instance one more thing you should be doing for preparation you should be collecting rainbow coin like hell because the next updates is for sure going to be rainbow coin i see the meaning by rainbow coin first we had a blue world now we have a green one and we're gonna have a red, purple, orange and so on worlds in the future. And all of the worlds is gonna be new worlds like these ones, new small worlds that is coming. So collect rainbow coin. I did this, I had 6 trillion before this and everyone who didn't do that, I, that I know, was regretting that. The thing for that, because I could hatch this egg here all the time. So for doing buy from merchant and mythical merchant if if the, this is also a little bit if it is best to hatch or buy, best to buy from merchant last update it was definitely best to buy from merchant because the drop rate for the mythical was like zero you could almost not hatch any mythical at all but then you had to rely on legendaries so it was all about buying from merchant Right? But in this patch, where the drop rate for the mythicals is really good, it is 90% hatching that helped me to the top 100, and 10% buying from friends uh, or so, and almost nothing from the, from the merchant, um, and so on. So, but at least the combination of hatching egg and buying from, from merchant, uh, that, that is uh, important. Uh, and then you also have to buy this mythical for your friends, so they are making mythicals for you. And you also should fuse up all of those legendary pets that you have. So up to um, the, the latest um, legendary, the, or the newest best legendary that you have. And that's a really good technique, you only fuse, need normally to fuse 3 and 3 until you get up to the best one. So that's quite easy way to do that. And after that, make them dark matter. When it comes to dark matter, then when you're doing dark matter, it's very important uh, that you use five to six pets in the machine at a time. You cannot not be working with one to four. That is going way too slow. Maybe you can use four when you are at sleep at night. But that's only then, else you have to use 5 to 6 because you have to generate a lot of dark matter yourself. On the legendary ones you have to use 6 on every one so that you can pump out one every 30 minutes or faster than that. And the last thing is uh, to buy from the marketplace. This is a time consuming but you have also to go there if you know, your friends is not helping you to produce enough and you can't not produce enough for that. And what you can do if, let's say, the new uh, new pets is only two times stronger, like in this version, it was quite good. I don't have these anymore, but the old dark matter had a, a, a value of uh, over 70 T. So it was stronger than the rainbow of the mythical we had now. So I went to the market and I bought a lot of these ones for a low price. So that's a really good way to get fast a lot of uh, power and that helped me really to get on that top 100. And also uh, if, if the, uh, the new pads is 15 times stronger like they normally has been, then it's better to go there and buy the new legendary pads. 
buy a lot of them in dark matter because they will go for a lower price normally and uh, towards the, the amount of power that, that you get you don't need to have like in the inventory you don't need to have every one of the strongest path that is something that you will need later on to get on top 100 or get to the top 10 then you will need to fill up the, everything it is also a huge benefit that you have huge pets because they are the, the giving the best value as possible for that so that's actually everything about doing it's not more to that than this but it's a, it will require a lot of focus and a lot of um, uh, playing so closing down the chat telling your friends that you're not gonna chat too much and answer and help them too much and other things that will help you because you need to stay focused to, to manage to do this in short time Step number four is celebrating and I'm gonna show you a clip of uh, how it was for me to get on the top 100 with my friends there and also I ended up to a place 58 or not many times I had just been playing since December but anyhow I have been trying uh, several times but that has been close to impossible but I had a really good plan now and also with some really good help this is possible and there we are on the top 100. Let's see where on the top 100, 100 we are. So this is interesting to see here. Where are we on the top 100? We are on 87. Not bad. Yeah. So see, I think there is a hoverboard. Yeah. <laughs> this looks good. <laughs> and the update didn't come when I hope. Oh, we are top 58. So we can become 58 here <laughs> for some reason. We are going up. <laughs> then we are come to step number five. And basically, after you have been on the top uh, 100 board, there is no need to stay there. This carpet that you are getting, the red one, or if you manage to get top 10, you get the blue one, you will keep that after. So you don't lose that if you go out of top 100. The reason I say this is that the mythicals that is making you so strong, like these ones here, they will fall in value over time. They will go from a price of yeah, two and a half billion down to 200 million and then after it they can f even fall down to like 60 million. There's a huge difference of two and a half billion and 200 million. So my recommendation is to go up there, celebrate, and then go and sell your pets. And generate a lot of diamonds and exclusive pets. My, uh, my experience by the selling so far is that um, I, am, I get the most sell when I'm selling towards exclusive pets. So, and that's no problem, because it's easy to buy with exclusive pets and so on, or, uh, or it is really easy to sell exclusive pets for diamonds. So, well, that's the last step for this guide, and thank you for, for that, and I hope really that you can make the top 100, but remember step 1, timing is the key behind everything here, okay? This was number 1 Game of Dan, Viper Toffee. And I hope you like the guide. I hope to see you again. Please like and subscribe and have fun. Enjoy the game. Thank you. Bye bye.